uh, visa complications. First of February, a lot of new rules came in here. Let's go. I'm going to get Maybell on the red wine. Could be entertaining. Richie, wake up. You're not going to be in it? Okay. Good afternoon. Welcome to today's video. We have a few things to share with you in this vlog today. It is Sunday, 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Maybell. What are you doing over there? Why are you not here with me? 4 p.m. 4 p.m. We just finished another mad busy Sunday in Maybell's Coffee Garden. Sunday is the busiest day by far. Hey, yeah. I don't know why, but it is. I think because uh, people on holiday, you don't care what day of the week it is, do you? But if you live here, a lot of people want to go out for breakfast on a Sunday, I think. Anyway, we are heading off to a beautiful, well, hopefully beautiful hotel for two days, we need a break, we need some relaxation time, don't we? And we're gonna share the place with you. Uh, yeah, had a good busy day, and now we're gonna chill for two nights, aren't we? Also, some visa complications, shall we, shall we say? We're gonna sort them out tomorrow, hopefully, and we'll share the findings also with you. But while we're here, before we go, I want to show you what is happening here in front of Maybell's Coffee Garden. You can't hide Maybell, I got you now, you can't hide. Okay, so they are building four brand new villas right in front of our shop, I mean literally right in front. Uh, I did show you in a recent video a villa for sale and the, the point I was trying to get at where it could be a good investment is this one here on the corner here bought by somebody, renovated, fully renovated, now renting out on Airbnb, and fetching somewhere in the region, high season, of 500 pounds per night. Per night, that's right. You can see here, look, this land here used to be, used to look like a jungle. But yeah, this is all being cleared here now, and you can see that property a bit better now. That's the one that's recently been done. There's another one down here that rents on Airbnb. Sleeping up to 10 people. That one looks beautiful inside. I want to get in and make a video, but still waiting people in it there at the minute. And this land has been cleared now here. Clear land. This land has been cleared to build four new villas. And if they're Airbnb villas, good for business in our place. I just want to show this. Two Thai guys have been here digging a well. Many places on this mountain here, water comes from a well. And they've been digging it by hand with two little shovel things, Thai style shovels. Two guys, and honestly, most of this thing done by hand. Now in the UK, I don't think you'd ever get two guys. But that's only this week, probably about four days. We got bloody deep in four days. So yeah, we're heading off. Just wanted to share that a little bit. Could be good news, obviously not good while they're building it, but later on, good news. Another busy day, time for us to take a break. Monday, close, you see. So we've got two nights in a plush hotel with a beautiful view and a beautiful restaurant, so we'll share all that with you now in this video. Where's Maybell? Let's go. <laughs> we have arrived. We are here at the Hilltop Hotel Residence. We have a beautiful view of Phuket Town, I believe this is, out to the east side, I think. What do you think? Anyway, we picked this hotel for a couple of reasons. Let's go take a walk. Uh, we knew it was going to be pretty quiet, it's out of the way here. 
It's good though. And it's beautiful, set into the mountain. Also, I've seen an advert for the restaurant. The uh, Plurn restaurant, very nice restaurant. We ate there last night. We actually arrived last night, by the way. We took a night to ourselves, didn't we? Yeah. Today we're gonna chill by the pool. We have the visa thing to sort out. Oh, that headache. Yeah, the visa headache. And now we're gonna give you a tour of this beautiful hotel. It's actually very nice. Location-wise, if you wanna, you know, go to the, all the attractions of Phuket, like, if you wanna be in the thick of it, this is not it. This is, you need transport, really, eh? Mm. We want it to be out the way. Away from people, sorry. That's how we roll on our days off. <laughs> we'll give you a tour of this place and also tonight we're going to have a four course tasting menu in the Plurn restaurant. Yeah. Aren't we? Okay, let's have a look around. We're starting at the top here. You start at the top, the hilltop. That's probably why it's called the hilltop. There's this nice walkway when you get to the top here, beautiful large pool. I've not used it, hey, it looks massive. You can not use it now. Look. <laughs> Infinity pool, great view. Bar, looks like there's a bar there, I'm not sure if that's open. Uh, on the top floor is the restaurant as well. No, actually, there's another floor. I was up bright and early this morning to check out the sunrise while this one was sleeping. Still sleeping now. <laughs> <laughs> Still sleeping now, it takes me about a while to wake up. This is the restaurant breakfast area, and yeah, we're gonna show you tonight. With the four course. Four course for me, Bill. <laughs> Everyone's having breakfast now. We'll go. Let's go down to the pool. Here, yeah, look, on this floor here. See the pool, and we've got some like lounge area. Pretty cool. Hey. That the book you can't reach. You can reach the books on the top balcony. Oh. Yeah, I like it. That's kind of different. I actually have a video chat to do later with a subscriber, so I'm going to do it from the lounge area. <laughs> yeah, look. Great views from everywhere here because obviously from the hilltop. Another reason we booked this hotel was, Mabel, price? Oh, the price is bargain again. It's 5,500 baht, include breakfast for two nights, two people. Two nights, 5,500, because gone are the COVID days. Is it cheap? <laughs> well, it's not that cheap, you know, COVID days are over now. Hotels here have really gone up a lot but this for the standard here this is oh wait there I forgot <laughs> for the standard here this is uh, this is good yeah I'm going to show the room I was going to show the room let's show you the room first forgot about that check it out decent size hey I like the view we got pool yeah. view or oh, we got pool view mountain view and sea view yeah, open the thing, let's have a look. Wow. Sea view's over there. Yeah, you can't, the water is over there. It's a little island. I think that's the east side, isn't it? I don't Pool's know. huge. Yeah, so 5,500 for two nights, breakfast included. Nowadays, that's good. You know, the COVID days are gone, aren't they? Yeah. COVID days, cheap, you know, the hotels here have really gone up in price. But this is a bargain, really. So now it's pool time. Yeah. It's relaxing time. Let's go, let's see. Get, uh, show your speed though. <laughs> but before, really, so you believe it's <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Yeah. Awesome pool, look at that infinity pool. Go on, son. Come on, Maybell. Swim. 
I can't swim away. <laughs> can. Swim. Swim towards me. Come on. I want to see your best. No. Come on. No. <laughs> what do you think to the pool? It's am up again. It's good, eh? Yeah. Huge pool. Beautiful view. You can just see the sea view. Cup. No. I'm not sure you can see on camera. A little island out there. Very nice. Okay, so now we have to take care of some business. Right, Mabel? Yes. <laughs> uh, visa complications. 1st of February, a lot of new rules came in here. Correct? Yes, Boss? change all the time. And due to having many visa stamps and other things throughout the years and now been advised or told that you'll have to leave the country and start again start fresh or the other option that we're trying to do now or arrange now is leave the country go to another bordering country and apply for a non B visa come back in that will give us how many days I can't remember now <laughs> three months three months on a non-B visa, well, then we can revert to the marriage visa again and then we'll be fine. That'll be a clear run forevermore. As long as you keep the 400,000 in the bank, 400,000 for marriage, 800 for retirement, keep the money in the bank. Uh, yeah, they're kind of getting pretty sweet on that thing now. Or have a work permit and more than 40,000 a month 40,000 a month in wages which I have but yeah something just went wrong along the way complications let's call it I don't really want to leave obviously but it's not of great timing because we're gonna have to somehow leave make an appointment at, at the embassy in Kuala Lumpur or Laos get there to submit the paperwork, make sure we get the stuff and come back all while closing the shop for a couple of days. We don't want to close for any longer. So that's the situation. Maybelle? What's happening there? Found the Finding number. Finding the number. Maybelle's going to find the number and we're going to try and make an appointment and sort it out right now. And yesterday was an alcohol free day in the hotel. Tonight is not. I'm looking forward to. A beer and a cocktail for Maybell. <laughs> okay, well, while further exploring this beautiful hotel, I found the gym on the last day on the first floor. Nice gym, you could get a good workout, taking full advantage of the beautiful views from this hilltop hotel. And I have to say, the, the locker room is huge and absolutely spotless very nice indeed I was impressed and we head up to the restaurant with a view this is where you have your breakfast and we had to try a bit of lunch to take advantage of the views during the daytime and yeah I have to say every meal we had here was delightful spaghetti bolognese very nice someone was very happy Mabel And I did notice they're offering yoga packages. Couldn't be much of a wellness resort without a yoga package. Very good. And they do offer a free shuttle bus service. Even though it's Monday, our day off, I have a one-to-one -one video chat booked with a subscriber who's interested to move here to Phuket. I want some guidance and some information from someone here, i.e. me. Uh, if anyone's interested in anything like this, I'll leave a link on the screen somewhere. Or you want to contact us for anything, we have the, it's like a, it's our link tree kind of page, email address, other stuff that we do. The link will be here and yeah.
It did not come. It did not. <laughs> Can you see in there? Yes. Wait. It's okay. Yeah. Six p.m. Dinner. Six p.m. I thought it was six thirty. Yes. Okay. Yes. Welcome back. You haven't been anywhere, but we have, haven't we? Where we've been? Where we've been? Well, we've been sorting things out. We've yeah. decided the visa situation has come to a critical decision, which is, Mabel. We, we have to leave the country. Yeah. <laughs> Quite a lumper. We haven't got time to mess around with appointments and, and non-B visas. We're just going to do a visa run, leave, come back, start fresh, clean slate, and do it the right way. Yeah? Yeah. But anyway, that's another video that will be coming soon because my visa runs out on March the 8th, which is next week. Next week. The week after. The week after next week. Uh, we should close the shop for one extra day. We'll have Monday closed, one extra day, back to resume back to business on the Wednesday, right? Mm -hmm. Now it's time for the four course tasting menu at the Plush Plurn restaurant at. I said this hotel wrong earlier, didn't I? It's actually called the Hilltop Wellness Wellness Resort. Yeah. Maybe they changed the name over the years. They jumped on the wellness wagon, Maybell. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go discreet mode with the DJI Pocket 2. Do it discreet style in the restaurant. Let's go. I'm gonna get Maybell on the red wine. Could be entertaining. And yeah, thank you all for the lovely comments on the last video. Oh yeah, very nice. You know, uh, we didn't do a video for a while. We asked for your for your input, and you gave us a load of comments. Top quality comments top notch Maybell <laughs> and I think we're going to do a video soon dedicating ourselves to reading out some of your beautiful comments the resounding top at the moment is stay as you are and open more hours yeah. that's what's coming the most and probably what we are going to do and probably was what we were going to do anyway so yeah we're on the same page people let's go for dinner Maybell? Let's go. Come on then, I follow you into the plush plurn restaurant. Check this out. Do 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 do. Very nice. Is this your table of choice? Yes. You sure? <laughs> Many nice tables inside. We'll go for this one outside. You have the sound of the Insects from the mountain. It's a bit overcast. Funnily, every time we try to make a video, it's overcast, right? Always. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna go for Let's test. Show me. Test show me. Choice three. This all Thai. There is. Uh, it's five courses. Sorry. Yeah. We said three, but four. But it's five. It's five. Oh my so goodness. Some have curry with rice noodle, yeah. rice noodle I like it, and of course something else, and yes, special one, papaya salad. Oh really? With, with grilled chicken. Oh right, okay. Okay, this is my five course. We're starting with uh, the cow soy, yeah. chef style cow soy, and then a deconstructed <laughs> green curry. Incredible. Pork neck, I like this one, I like the pork neck. And then what is this? What is this? Down the bottom here. Sea bass. I think sea bass. Steam sea bass. And then this strange looking Tom Yang concoction, Gung. Tom Yang Gung. Yeah. Gonna check out the wine they have. You can see in here as well. Air con. Beautiful view. We want white or red, maybe. White. White? white. I thought wanted red. Oh, red, okay. Uh, open cup? Yeah. Open cup. <laughs> <laughs> 
there's lots of dishes but they're all it's like a I'm not sure what the style how, how uh, I would call it. they said it's it's chef secret recipe chef secret recipe how I would call it in the UK is it's posh it's uh, fancy dishes very nice but small I had how many dishes did I have last month three yeah and maybe I had how many three years ago <laughs> Three, like three each, and we still wasn't full up. But it was all very nice, so yeah. Yeah, and you had cow soy as well. Yeah, that's the best cow soy. Yeah. And he had he had it today as well. Yeah, well it's on it's on the taste the menu set. Oh. It goes up into that. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So what you said. Anyway, let's try this one. <laughs> My food usually comes before yours, right? Always. <laughs> Man first. Oh shit, that's good. good. Yeah, it's just the food here, every dish that we have been eating is just so nice. But it's too small. <laughs> yeah. No, going in now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, this, is, this is some of the best. Yeah, and uh, look, look. Yeah. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and they put it back in. <laughs> so this is a uh, tom yum. Tom yum, yeah. Put, put again. <laughs> every dish. Is <laughs> yeah, we're not joking. Last night we were going, wow, every dish. Yeah. Very good, but small. Uh, oh, that my fish cake, I think. Uh, oh, a bit spicy this one. Okay, May Bell has a dish to try. Fish cake, yes. Yeah. Looks looks bloody good. Come on, give us a Really? Good? Yeah. Really? Very good. <laughs> yeah. Very good. The food here is just so nice. Yeah. It's nice and small. <laughs> nice and small. But hey, if you get Five dishes should be good. Try that one. Pork neck. I like this one anyway, don't I? Let's see Maybell's verdict. <laughs> good, eh? How good? <laughs> Very good. Uh, last night Maybell had desserts. Mango and sticky rice. The sticky rice was in. That's the best mango sticky rice I have ever had in my life. Sticky rice was in uh, spring rolls, wasn't it? Yeah. Beautiful. Mm. Very nice. I'm not joking. This is like everything we try is so nice. You sure? You're right. You had too much of that wine already. <laughs> Pretty spicy. Really? Mm. What's the verdict? Not spicy enough for me. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. You like five chilies. A bit more pork. Pork. This one. Green curry. Deconstructed green curry, and this is a sea bass. <laughs> On some. Oh, what's happening here? Eggs underneath and hay. <laughs> you can oh, right, it's on top. All oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Come on then. What's your one? Hang le curry. Hang. Oh, my my pork. No, not your pork. Oh, go on then. Try it. Sweet. Sweet. Not spicy enough for you. Nice. 
you're going to eat. Okay. Yeah, look. Deconstructed green curry. So, is this. That is fish ball. That's fish ball. Oh my god. I don't do fish balls. Come on, try it. Yeah, I'll try a little bit, but. What's this? Uh, I don't know. And this is the green curry sauce. Let's put some of that on there. Ooh, very nice. Actually, now I've got these two dishes in front of me, I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> I need to try and eat more fish. I'm not a big fish eater. Let's try the sea bass. It's all right, good. A bit plain. I could do a bit more salt. What about that one? Okay, let's try this fish ball. Every time Mabel eats this, I just say to her, oh my god. <laughs> the consistency, consistency I don't really like. <laughs> Not for me. What? This one big fish ball. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I like it. I'd rather it was a meatball. It's all right. Okay, this is Maybell's dish number three. Three. I think. three. Yeah. I've had four already, eh? Okay. What is it? Blue chicken looks nice. Papaya salad is like a baby food. You know, when I eat papaya salad, I always eat with pharmacy fish. But this one like Palang style. Ah, <laughs> this is weakened down for for the foreigners, yeah. Baby food, he said. <laughs> the fish balls went down very well, kind of. What <laughs> mm. salad? How? It's good to eat baby food sometimes. What is it like, fruity style? Mm -hmm. I think I could eat it. Yes. Mm, let's try the grilled chicken. I love chicken. My kind of food. Mm. Yeah. Nice. I think actually, if you are new to Thai food, it's a very good way. Hey. Mm -hmm. What do you think? A very good way to try many dishes. Going 750, not pretty good actually. Not too bad, it's better than buying every single dish. Yeah, what are these? These look like a I don't know, crispy tortillas. What? Sure, quite nice. Bit of green curry on there. Mm. Actually, they're meant to go with this. Mm. I like this one. Yes. Well, as you can see, it's so amazing. far, so good. Hey, Mabel. Have my last dish. Mabel's on her last dish. This is. I think it's called. I don't know. Spicy clear soup. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what it's called. It looks like pork. pork. Uh, rib, oh. little pork ribs in there. Yeah. How is it? Be honest. Blend for me. Blend, yeah, you need you need spice, don't you? And unbelievably, it's raining. You know, the weather, since we stopped making videos, nothing but sunshine. And then as soon as we start, it rains. We call this sod's law. What do you call it? Nothing. <laughs> okay. Do we get a dessert with our food? If not, we're going to order one. I'm going to get that. It's, uh, what's it called? Mango and sticky rice. Oh my god, that was banging. Bring on it. Mango and sticky rice. Where's my wine? Oh, well, let me down here. Put me up. Ooh. 
<laughs> well, we thought it was all over, but it's not. Maybe I'll one more dish to go. So what's the left, Maybe? <laughs> One crab more curry, crab curry with rice noodles. Noodles, you know, this this is this menu. Mm. Uh, southern Thai people they eat for breakfast, really. Yeah, breakfast. Mm, breakfast. Yeah, I see them always getting this noodle, the stringy noodle, wrapped up with this, and they just mix it together yeah. and eat it like this. Maybell and, and our staff do it quite a lot, eh? Yeah, out of bags. Put it in bags, yeah. little plastic bags. It's yeah. nice. Well, you have to try it. Mm, maybe, but not really for me. Thank you. I'll stick with omelet, or <laughs> I don't really eat the body breakfast that much. I love the cucumber. I'm trying to eat healthy. Okay. Really? Yeah. That's okay. cow soy. Cow soy. Yes. I thought I'd had all my digits, but obviously not. <laughs> One more, cow soy. Usually cow soy, the noodle is fried. Some place. Some place. Yeah. Right everywhere. Okay. Here, not. Chicken, noodles, and the sauce. Oh, look at that. The sauce here is so nice. Mm. Man, what else? Maguin style. <laughs> okay. Hmm. This is the dessert Mabel had last night. So the rice, the rice is in the spring roll. Different. This is like a what is this? Coconut cream sauce. And you have the mango ice cream, sticky rice in there. Trust me, when you put this, all this stuff together. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> it's like. Mmm. Wow. <laughs> it's good. Wait, how many? I think the coconut and the rice. Maybe because you fry it as well. Yeah, very good. The mango this time is. This is a bit less. Yeah, when the mango look green. It's less ripe than what it should be. When you put that, that, and that, and that together, mm, it's nice. Your turn. What is yours? Lemon tart for me. Lemon tart. We have it last night. Yeah. Same, same. It can taste like normal. It can taste like lemon. <laughs> yeah, I mean, is it, is it nice? No. Too sweet? Sweet enough? Sour. Sour? Good. Tangy. It's good. Good, good. Yeah, I think it's like a combination. I'm no uh, food expert, but... The combination makes it work. Okay, find the flights, babe. Richie, wake up! <laughs> Good morning. morning. Time for checkout. Yeah. We just had our delicious breakfast sitting over here. This beautiful view. Sun is shining. Yeah, back to work today. Uh, we forgot to share the cost of the food last night, Maybell. How much was it? The bill was 5,400 baht because someone had two bottles of wine. <laughs> yeah, wine is expensive in Thailand. Anybody want to do business? Import wine to me and we'll set it up. <laughs> right. Time for us to go back to work. Yeah. All the details for this hotel. I like it. Do you? What do you think? I like it. Yeah, I'll, I'll actually come and stay again. Uh, yeah, that's it. We've got to go to work now, haven't we? Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Okay. See you in the next one. Bye. Oh yeah. By the way, 
we have booked our flights. We are going to Kuala Lumpur. So yeah, that's coming soon. See you in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.